So the last time we had Kay Lee on, he was not happy with his wife's surgeon. Go ahead and reset that. Yeah, well, it wasn't necessarily me that was unhappy. It was my wife that was expressing her unhappiness about how her third C-section, they went through the same scar, um, was healing up. Not only did the right side of the scar hurt, that was the only part she was complaining about that continued to ache and, and be painful, but she was not liking the look of how it was healing. And it was puckered, was, right? You said it looked, looked like, kind of like a bullet hole. So instead of having like you have a scar and it's still somewhat smooth, there was this right. weird indentation. I said bullet hole. Davi said pocket. Yeah. And, pocket. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, she's like, yeah. oh, she's like a kangaroo. She's a human yeah. kangaroo. Yeah. Kangaroos, possums. Do you know little otters have a little pocket? They put their oh. little pebble in. Oh, call her that. Your little, oh, you're so cute, my little otter. She'll love that. Little otter. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let me put something in your pocket. So, um, <laughs> it took a turn. <laughs> yes, Mo, it did. <laughs> so, um, I was like, well, babe, if you're that unhappy with it, you know, there's always plastic surgery, you know, I, but I still think, that you're shedding weight because it's only been six weeks. And so her body is trying to get back to normal pre baby. Um, and you told her what she's what three pounds away from you actually touching her again is what you said, Stop right? It, Bert. <laughs> Stop it, Bert. <laughs> I said, uh, it might be time for an upgrade. <laughs> Stop. So I was joking. Oh, I was just joking. I'm joking before. Y'all are making me sweat. Down. Anyway, he's got a, uh, he's got a sliding scale. When she lost some weight, he started holding her hand. When she lost a little bit more weight, he started kissing oh. her. And now three more pounds, and he starts touching her again. I think that was really right. cool of you. I want to come through the screen and punch you in the face. Good motivation. Which one, me or Bert? Both of you. Both. <laughs> okay. yeah, yeah. I got two hands. So, <laughs> right? So my wife had an appointment on Wednesday of last week, which on Wednesday morning she came down and she rescheduled it for Friday. Come Friday, I didn't go with her because I had to stay here with the herd. All three <laughs> children. Herd. Yeah, yeah. Love them, but they're the herd. And yeah. don't forget the four dogs, the guinea pig, and everything else that's around here. So um, she goes to the doctor, and I think... I'm guessing the doctor was probably waiting for her on Wednesday to come in and was probably pretty bummed when she rescheduled for Friday because the whole office listens to the show, Oof. including the surgeon. And so she heard what I said. So I think she was very eager to see Aaron's stomach so she could make a diagnosis for herself. Mm -hmm. Her first diagnosis, she said, was to tell me that she's not allowed to have sex with me for another six weeks. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're okay, but you're okay with that because she hasn't dropped the weight yet. And I never said that at all. <laughs> so apparently, uh, where the the right side, where there's this pocket or bullet hole, whatever you want to call it. Um, <laughs> That's where they um so that's where they tied it off the sutures. So it it's I guess it's clumpier like inside in that area in that vicinity. That's where they but tied why, off. Okay, that's fine. But why I'm, why didn't it look like that the two times before then? That's a yeah, I wasn't there to ask those questions. Well, but the yeah, I'm sorry. Go ahead. With Dobby. with I mean with scar tissue, if you just keep Cutting it open, putting it back, cutting it open, and putting it back. That's there's going to be a buildup of scar tissue. Mm -hmm. Like that's just that could be that's like one of reopening the, the same wound that like tried so hard to close. The other is that she, the doctor said massage that area, mm. and it might break up some of those um, sutures, but it hurts. So she, uh, Aaron said that um, when the doctor even touched it, she was like, "Okay, I don't like that." The end result is that, you know, I think she's looking better and better every day. So, like, I think it's going to be less of an issue. But if it's still an issue to her, then I guess plastic surgery could be in the future. But she won't have sex with me for another six weeks. <laughs> <laughs> Moral of the story. She's going to keep going back to the surgeon, yeah. man. Yeah, <laughs> I don't want you to right. <laughs> so, the, well, her loss... 
So the surgeon said that this is um, pretty common then. Yeah. Um, yeah, I guess. Well, that's the way she made it out to be. I mean, you know, as a surgeon. I, well, let me just ask, pose this question. Is the surgeon going to go, yeah, I messed it up. So what did I say Oops. last time? What did I say last time? <laughs> Doctor's remember. not going to admit they did something wrong. Never. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, never. Never, never. Now, I mean, she might not have. And like I said, her stomach might go back to normal if maybe she wants me to massage that area. So, yeah. so. <laughs>